this do this of course i didn't eye fling that because i'm trash i didn't eye fling that again Project Yohane. Well, hello there, my little demons. I'm the fallen angel who descended into this world from heaven, Yohane. And welcome back to Genshin Impact. So today, I'm going to show you all some of the uh, best team for Raiden Shogun. I, I actually have five team that I'm going to show you in this video. And one of them, I'm pretty sure you guys already know, which is the one that I'm going to show first. So, yeah. Without further ado, let's do this. Team number one will be, of course, Raiden herself, Sinchu, the Net, and Shangli. And this team is known as National Team. And yes, they are pretty popular. You can see this team everywhere. Guys, believe me or not, this team is pretty strong. Not just pretty, but very strong. Why? The Net, he got his ult. Sinchu, he got his ult. And every time you auto attacking, there's this water sword thingies uh, flying around the uh, screen. And then Shangli, she have her uh, ultimate, which is I think uh, the pyro needle. Yeah, her pyro needle deals a lot of damage. Plus, thanks to Sinchu's sword, pause on that one. Thanks to Sinchu's uh, Hydro or Virgil sword, you can activate the uh, vaporize. Yes, yes, yes. So yeah. All right, so we have the Pyro Rock Frog, aka the Orange Rock Frog. It looks so adorable. Look at him. I love chunky monsters. Okay, do this, and then do this, and then punch, and then do this, and then summon the uh, Krillin Slicer, and then do this, Magush. Okay, I'm not sure if that was crit. I don't think that was crit. And just like that. Okay. That's way too fast! I'm telling you, this team is pretty strong. Like, super strong. Time to fight the Copium couple. We have Copium Lia and Copium Lius. Do the uh, old... Well, uh, not old, uh... The usual rotation. But Gush, I didn't see the number. Okay. Oh my god, this team is so nuts. It's so strong, it's just so broken. Like whoever come up with this team, you're so genius. Okay, so here's my Sinchu stats. The thing is, my Sinchu stats, they're not fully upgraded yet. So yeah, because I don't usually play these characters, Sinchu and Banette. So yeah, he sees sex and that's his talent. I know, right? Don't even tell me. Alright, so here's my Bennett. He's actually level 90. I level 90 him for nothing. I mean, he's just for trolls. Okay, so that's that. He, he, uh, he is C6 and I'm only upgrading his ult. Now we have Shanli. So for my Shanli, she's using Favonius Lance. And then she's using Pyro Set. There we go. And Constellation 6 Talon, I upgraded Pyro Needle. So yeah, that's national team. Second team, if you guys love physical, then I think this will be the best team for you. We have Eula, Rosaria, and Jean. And of course, Raiden Shogun. Well, Eula, you already guys know Eula. She is the physical queen. She deals a huge amount of physical damage Rosaria, why she's there? she can become a battery plus her ult every time you're using her ult inside of her uh, ult radius you can decrease the enemy's uh, physical resistance by I think 15% or maybe bigger than that, I'm not sure well Jin is there well, why not? I mean, she can become a healer I mean, instead of Jin, if you guys own Mika you can just bring him instead this Mika he can also become a great buff, at least for Eula or any other physical characters, right? But in my case, I don't own Mika. That's why I am going to bring Jin instead. Look, we have a Pyro Rock Frog again. Nice. Okay, so for this rotation, let's see. Uh, wait for him to finish his roar thingy and then do this. Yes, and then do this for the uh, physical reduce or resistance reduce, I don't know. Do that, do the combo, do this, and then keep stacking, keep attacking, yeah. While we stack the ult, 
There we go and now you have to do this and then the goose There we go And his dad See, even with this team, Eula is usable Well, all you have to do is use every burst and once every burst are uh, has been used You can just use Raiden's burst, right? So with Raiden's burst you can easily refund all those energies back so you can rotate back again with you last pull. That's how strong this team is. Okay, so do this. Okay, do the charge attack, keep attacking. Unfortunately, I got my attack speed got slowed. So that's that, and then do this. And yes, just like that. That's how you do the rotation, I guess. I mean, I didn't refund some of the energy because the enemy just died Just like that I mean, if you keep attacking, you can refund the energy back And since I'm using C6 Raiden You can spam all the ults, like every rotation So yeah, here are my Eula's relics by the way She's using 4P Spill Flame She's Constellation 0 That's that And we have Rosaria right here so yeah, that's her stats. Weapon, she's only using Favonius Lance because it's the most F2P one. So yeah, she's using Ice Set and she's C6 and that's her talent. And here's my Jean. I mean, I'm pretty sure people already know my Jean, but just in case. There you go, she's using Vivi... Uh... Virdescent? I I'm calling it Vivi Shred, yeah. So that's that. Next team we have Hyper Bloom team. In this team we have Hotaru or aka uh, Lumin Dendro version and Kuki Shinobu for healing and Sentu for hydro application. Another rock frog pyro! Okay, okay, okay. Wait for it to do his roar thingy. Yeah, he's mouthing every day. And now do this. Do this. Of course, I didn't eye frame that because I'm trash. I didn't eye frame that again. I'll use her ult. Just like that so I can maximize my result. Once everything's maxed, I can just do this. Look at this. Hyper Bloom. Hyper Bloom. This team is very flect uh, flexible. And just like that. Alright, do the same rotation. There we go. Let's wait for them to do their thing. Once they're done, we can spam everything like this. This, this, and then drop it. And then do this. Do this, do that, and switch to Raiden with U. There we go. Look at this. Look how fast this is. Oh my god. And just like that. Hyper Bloom, Raiden Shogun. So, yeah. Very strong. Instead of uh, Dendro Hotaru or Dendro Lumin, you can use Tahida. And uh, instead of Sinju, you can use. Uh, what is her name? Yellen. Yeah. Anyways, here are my Hotaru's build. She's a Dendro, Sacrificial Sword R5, and she's using 4 piece people memories. Because why not? And she's only C5 because I'm too lazy to collect the uh, Dendro killers. Here's my homie Shinobes. So she has like, uh, what you call this? Elemental Mastery. She's using Dark Iron Sword and 4 piece Paradise Lost. And she's Constellation 6. And Talent, 12. Yeah, two 12s. And here's my Sinchu. It's the same Sinchu except he's using weaker sacrificial sword. Because the uh the other sacrificial sword he used earlier is now using by uh Hotaru, yeah. But the next we have Aggravate Team. In this team we have Dendro Hotaru, aka Lumin, for Dendro application, we have Jean. For healing plus Verdescent proc or Verdescent Shred or whatever you call that thing. And finally, we have Kujo Sara to amplify my Raiden Shogun's damage. Oh my god. Of course, it's Electro Rock Frog. And it, they know I'm going to use this team. They know. Okay. It doesn't matter. We can do this. Do the same rotation. Now, here's with Jean. There we go, Vivi Shred, and then there we go, Lightning Slippers. Was that a crit? I, I can tell if that was a crit. I don't think that was a crit. 
and the Gooch. This team is so good. I freaking love this team. Oh my god. Yeah. Alright. Copium couple. Well, the thing is, every time you're going to start fighting, always drop a uh, Potaru's ultimate. So in that way, while you are switching characters, you activating Quicken plus Aggravate. Thanks to Raiden's E. And just like that. It's easy as that. Yeah, it's easy as that. This team is ridiculously strong. Oh my goodness. Alright, so again, here's my Hotaru's uh, set or stats. Sacrificial Sword, Deep Old Memories, you guys already know. I mean, just in case, I'm just re-showing my stats. Just in case, okay? Because people might gonna say, oh, you cut. You, you cut it, you switch something, blah blah blah, no. Just in case, here we go. Vivid Shred, or Vivid Set, or Vivid Descent, no, not Vivid, what am I saying? Okay, so here's my, uh, Kujo Sara, she's using Fabonius Warbo, she's supposed to be using Fading Twilight, or, uh, Skyward Heart, but they're like limited or let's say fading twilight is unlimited while skyward harp is a uh, five star weapon so yeah and here are her relics and she's constellation six c6 is super strong especially with raiden yeah now we have the fifth and the final team of this video overload team we have raiden herself chevy g and Sarah. Recently, Overload got buffed and it's all thanks to Chevy. Every time you trigger Overload, enemies electro and power resistances are massively getting lower. Jean, you guys already know why she's here, Baby Shred, and Sarah, you guys already know, Electro Damage Amplifier. So yeah, he's just chillaxing, look at him. He's so adorable. I know I already said that earlier. I just love him. Okay, do this for the Overload, do this for the Vivi Shred, do this for Raiden buff, and of course that didn't crit. Yes, of course my attacks doesn't crit. I'm using one of my strongest team and my attacks doesn't crit. Oh, of course. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. Okay, do this again for the iframe. The Goosh and Bakersh. I don't think that was crit. I'm not sure. Okay. They will love to dance. I mean, look at them. Okay, there we go. Like douche. Do this. Do that. Just to ride in. There we go. And just like that. And they're dead. Of course. This team is strong. Yeah, I'm just saying. Especially with C6 uh, Shev Reuse. C6 Shev Reuse is super good. Alright, I'm gonna show you all my Chevy's uh, stats. There we go. She's using Kavonius Lance. Uh, usually, I'm using... Oops, no, not that one. Uh, usually, I'm using this weapon because of its design. But since this one is a battle pass weapon, I'm gonna just use the uh, Favonius uh, Lance instead. So, yeah. She's using 4 piece Noblesse for the extra support, you know, team buff. And she's C6. Look at her C6. Look at this. After a member party is healed, blah, 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 blah. They gain Pyro and Electro bonus. And, and yeah, that's that. She's just super good. Yeah, she's really designed for overload team. She is super good. Yeah, and here you go. Here's my Jean. Again, it's the same uh, set. So there you go. And so was my Sarah, same set, or stats, weapon for bonus warble, you already know why. And she's using 2-piece noblesse and 2-piece uh, emblem for the energy recharge, and double crown. And finally, of course, my Raiden Shogun. Of course, I, I'm gonna show you all my Raiden Shogun. I mean, my Copium stats Raiden Shogun, because she has below 50% crit. And you ha uh, you guys have to use this weapon if you guys don't have the uh, the engulfing and dragon's bane if you're going to use uh, hyper bloom raiden. So yeah, I only use engulfing because it's my favorite weapon for my raiden. So yeah, and she's using four piece emblem of severed fate and she's constellation six and old crown. Guess 
do I have to say why? Alright ladies and gentlemen, so those are Raiden Shogun's team or let's say uh, top 5 best I don't want to say top 5 best but for me at least For me, these are the uh, top 5 Raiden Shogun's best team Because I'm pretty sure some other people have their own uh, preferences or something like that But for me, they are the uh, top 5 so yeah, I mean if you guys are going to ask me who is the uh, or what is the best team For me if you are or if you just started recently and Raiden is your first 5 star character Just go for the national team, it's the most flexible one I mean you guys saw me uh, killing enemies earlier, defeating enemies earlier Using uh, low invested Sinchu or uh, Bennett So yeah, national team is super good, okay? So yeah, and what else? I, I guess that's all. And oh, also, also, yeah, 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 I forgot to tell you. Before you guys tell me, Yopi, you, your riding is super strong because you're riding in C6. No. First of all, I started my, uh, I, I started playing Raiden. Yes, I started playing Raiden when she was C0. Yeah, I started with C0 Raiden, and slowly, I make. I made her into C6 every rerun ban. Okay, I'm not a whale because I'm pretty sure people will gonna say that. Especially my channel is new, right? And people don't know or uh, they don't know how I got these uh, constellations, right? So that's why I'm explaining it right now. So yeah, that's that. That's how I got my C6 right in and it's her rerun, right? Before, before her rerun, uh, my Raiden was uh, Constellation 5, so when her rerun comes out or came out, uh, that's when I got the uh, C6 Raiden Shogun. So, yeah. I guess that's all. So, yeah, again, if you are new in this game and Raiden Shogun is your first 5 star, go for the national team. That's just me recommending things to you. I'm not saying you must build them, I'm just recommending it, okay? So, that's that. Again, that's gonna be it for this video thank you guys for tuning in if you guys still enjoy watching this video just make sure to hit that like button down below and if you're new just make sure to hit the subscribe button and also check out the other contents of my channel as well if you might like him i don't know i love you guys i'ma see you all again in the next video how to little demons yay bye bye